Water contamination by fuel oil can lead to several adverse effects such as environmental pollution, health and safety risks, loss of resources, heavy fines and high maintenance costs. Don't pollute the environment. Be responsible with O2 Pit and Seku Multitank. In a petrol station, tank overfilling, improper hose connection and product mixing during fuel delivery possesses great threat to fuel leakage into the environment and loss of business. For these reasons, an adequate system should be installed in the tank that can prevent environmental pollution and increase operational efficiency. Zekutec presents the O2 pit and the Zeku Multitank, a safety system to eliminate these problems. consists of several compartments filled with different fuels that needs to be delivered to their respective storage tanks. The Zeku Multitank shows the content of the compartments in the main display. The truck is connected to the ground with the help of an earthing cable. The O2 bit system is installed on the top of the underground tank and the connection to the tank truck is realized by electrically conductive hoses. Scenario 1. Hose connection control without O2 pit and Zeku multitank. Due to human error, the filling hose is not properly connected to the underground tank during fuel delivery. Without the O2 pit and the Zeku multitank, when the fuel is delivered from the tank truck, fuel leakage occurs and a part of the fuel flows into the environment and enters the earth. Doing it better, thanks to O2 pit and Zeku multitank. Scenario 1. Hose connection control with O2 pit and Zeku multitank. The O2 pit is now installed on the tank with proper electrical connections to the underground tank delivery inlet. The electrically conductive hose is not properly connected to the underground tank. Now when the fuel is pumped from the tank truck, the delivery will be blocked by the Zeku multitank as no closed loop for the electricity flow is established between the Zeku multitank and the delivery inlet, which indicates a hose disconnection. When the electrically conductive hose is properly connected to the underground tank, electricity flows from the Zeku multitank to the delivery inlet and then returns through the earthing cable to the Zeku multitank, making a closed loop. The Zeku multitank thus ensures a correct hose connection and then allows for the fuel delivery. Scenario 2 Product identification for crossover prevention without O2 pit and Zeku multitank. The compartment in the tank truck with Fuel 95 is connected to the underground tank filled with diesel through the filling hose. Proper hose connection is established between the tank truck and the underground tank. Without the O2 pit and Zeku multitank, when the fuel is delivered from the tank truck, the Fuel 95 is pumped into the underground tank with diesel and product mixing occurs. Doing it better, thanks to O2 pit and Zeku multitank. Scenario 2 Product identification for crossover prevention with O2 pit and Zeku multitank. The O2 pit is now installed on the tank with proper electrical connections to the delivery inlet of the underground tank filled with diesel. The electrically conductive hose is correctly connected between the tank truck and the underground tank. 
The Zeku Multitank is pre-programmed with the electrical product code of 95 fuel and the O2 pit is pre-programmed with the electrical product code of diesel. When the 95 fuel is pumped into the underground tank, the truck amplifier compares the pre-programmed 95 fuel product code with the product code stored in the O2 pit, which is diesel. Due to the mismatch or crossover, the Zeku Multitank does not allow for the fuel delivery. Zeku Multitank recognizes the mismatch of the products and keeps the bottom valve closed. The red lamp and the X signal the failure. No wrong product will be pumped into the underground tank and product crossovers are prevented. Zeku Multitank compares the product code of the O2 pit with the product in the connected compartment and opens the bottom valve in case of matching. Information goes through the conductive hose. Scenario 3. Overfill prevention for fuel drop without O2 pit and Zeku Multitank. The compartment in the tank truck with diesel is correctly connected to the diesel underground tank through the filling hose and a proper hose connection is also established. Without the O2 pit and Zeku Multitank, when fuel is pumped into the underground tank, the tank can reach its maximum capacity and causes an overfill. The hose will also be filled with excess fuel. Once the pumping is stopped and the hose is disconnected from the underground tank, the excess fuel flows into the environment and can reach the underground water. Doing it better thanks to O2 pit and Zeku Multitank. Scenario 3. Overfill prevention for fuel drop with O2 pit and Zeku Multitank. The O2 pit is now installed on the tank with proper electrical connections to the delivery inlet of the underground tank. The electrically conductive hose is correctly connected between the tank truck and the underground tank with both tanks filled with diesel. The fuel is now pumped into the underground tank and when the fuel reaches the maximum level and touches the optical prism of O2 pit sensor, the status of the sensor changes. The O2 pit signals the maximum allowed level in the station tank. Zeku Multitank closes the bottom valve immediately and shows this status with a filled tank symbol. Information goes through the conductive hose. The excess fuel flows into the tank and overfill is prevented. With properly installed O2 pit and Zeku Multitank, the excess fuel on the hose can also be accommodated in the tank, even if the overfill point is reached. 